David Erickson with the eStrategy Internet Marketing Blog at e-strategyblog.com uh, for today's uh, video podcast. I want to take a look at a new feature that Google has added uh, for multiple logins. So if you're um, like me and uh, you have several uh, Google accounts, maybe you have one for your personal use and one for your for one of your blogs like I do, um, or one for personal use and one for client work, which I often do as well, or for whatever reason you have multiple um, Gmail accounts, what I used to have to do is um, use them by uh, opening different browsers. So I could be logged in at the same time uh, under two accounts, uh, one on Chrome, for instance, another on uh, Firefox, so I could work uh, simultaneously logged into two accounts. Now, Google has added an option now to allow you to sign in in uh, simultaneously using multiple accounts. So if you go to your google.com uh, slash accounts uh, page, you will see if you're logged in the option to uh, log in in multiple accounts. So I'm going to edit and uh, give myself the option. You can see I am uh, logged in on my personal account right now. And so when I am uh, have a multiple login, uh, when, the, when it's turned on, you can click on an arrow next to your name uh, at the top right of your account and switch between accounts with these uh, products. So it's Calendar, uh, Google Code, Gmail, Reader, Sites, Voice, and they will probably add additional ones um, as they roll this out. So I want to use this. Uh, the account... Select the checkbox, confirm you understand how multiple uh, sign in to use it. The account you're currently using is displayed at the top of Google Pages, at the bottom of the most pages of the mobile devices. Uh, ta -ta -ta -ta. Not all Google products, yes, I understand that. Google products not listed above will be default, but the first, okay, so the Google, Google products not listed above, so with the exception of these Google services, um, if you try to access like YouTube when you're logged in, uh, to multiple accounts, it will default to the first um, account that you signed in. Use your current browser session. So uh, in this case, it would be defaulting to my uh, my personal uh, Gmail account. Okay, and offline mail and offline calendar will be disabled. Okay, I understand. Save. Okay, my account information has been updated and saved. Now. Let's go back, and now I have an arrow next to my name so I can uh, log in under multiple accounts, sign in to another account. Okay. All right, so I can now sign in. Uh, I am now signed in, and I can switch between uh, my accounts. So that's nice. I can go to Google Reader. And read my personal uh, feed. Alright, or I go to my strategy reader and read those feeds. Very nice. Uh, that will save a lot of time. So this has been a uh, video podcast of the eStrategy Internet Marketing Blog at e-strategyblog.com. Come visit, and when you visit, make sure to uh, subscribe to the RSS news feed so you don't, don't miss any posts or content, uh, and or follow me on Twitter at d erickson.